Well, hey there, just a short video today. So I ran into an issue with a pot. <clears throat> it was giving me some problems and I wasn't quite sure what was going on. And I didn't test it before using it. So I thought it'd be a good idea to show you how to test a pot before you put it in and then cause yourself a bunch of headaches, right? <laughs> so I've got the multimeter here set up for ohms to show resistance. So if you take your pot, so this is an alpha 500 pot right here. You can see A500K right there. So the middle lug is going to be your output. So I'm going to put the hot on that one. And then we're going to take the black and put it on the right hand lug. Now if you spin around your pot, you can see the value change. So now we're at, well, we're basically at zero here. I'm going to turn it all the way up. And we get to 532. So this is a 500k pot. So it's a little hotter than 500, but that's okay. So that's how you test. So this, this pot's working fine. <laughs> so I won't hesitate to use that. But this is the pot that was giving me problems. It's actually a one meg pot, an alpha one meg. And for some reason, the volume, it would go all the way up, but it wouldn't turn off. So when I went all the way down, it would still let some uh, signal through. So I figured out that, you know what, it's probably the pot, right? So here, do the same thing, output in the middle. And put the black here on the right hand lug. And let's start turning this around. Yeah, it's giving us nine. I don't even know what it's doing here. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing. So this pot, see I'm turning it and there's no reading at all. So for some reason, this pot is no good. <laughs> so that's going to go in the garbage, so I don't use it again by accident. But just a lesson learned, you should always check your pots, your new ones, if you're replacing them. Check, check them before you put them in. All right? Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.